This week, our Desmond Shaw is steering SkyCal to the north to check out the Santa Clarita Valley. And in tonight's look at this, he's over a sprawling park in Newhall that has a lot to offer. We'll take a look at this beautiful home. This is the William S. Hart Mansion and Regional Park, a 265-acre park and museum just north of the Newhall Pass. This was the home of cowboy and silent movie star William S. Hart, one of the era's biggest names. A little more about Mr. Hart led quite a colorful life. Born in 1864 in New York, he dreamed of a life on the wild frontier and spent his youth on ranches in the Dakotas, Wisconsin, and Minnesota, making friends with Native Americans, gold prospectors, outlaws, and Civil War veterans. He, when his family moved to New York City, he pursued a career in stage acting and found some success in Shakespeare productions, but in 1913, he was so shocked and disappointed at the way that Western movies were being portrayed that he decided to make the pivot to movies in order to make authentic Western films, and he found dramatic success in the genre, starring in 70 films in less than 10 years, some of which were the most profitable films of the time. He retired from the business in 1925 and set upon building his dream home high on a hill here on the Horseshoe Ranch. He named his 10,000 square foot Spanish colonial revival mansion La Loma de los Vientos, or Hill of the Winds, he was a beloved figure in the Santa Clarita community and a generous philanthropist. You'll see his name in many places across town. The local school district, high school, and a baseball diamond all bear his name. He also donated a lot of money to the local Boys and Girls Club and the Los Angeles SPCA. Hart lived on the estate with his sister Ellen until she died in 1943. He passed in 1946. And he was quoted as saying, when I was making pictures, the people gave me their nickels and dimes. When I'm gone, I want them to have my home. And so, in his will, he left his entire estate to the people of Los Angeles County. Today, this is a huge regional park with the mansion serving as a museum of the Old West. The property also includes the Santa Clarita Historical Center, an adobe house that dates from 1865 that was moved to this location, an old steam locomotive and caboose, and a petting zoo with lots of different animals. Also, according to OnlyInYourState.com, there's a herd of free-roaming bison on the property that can be seen grazing the hillsides. Unfortunately, as of this look, the mansion itself is closed until further notice as ownership of the park transfers from the county to the city of Santa Clarita, but the rest of the park remains open and there are plans to reopen the mansion eventually. Hartmuseum.org to learn more about this gem in the southern Santa Clarita Valley. Taking a look at this from SkyCal, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at look at this at cbs.com.